The name of our business is Tree of the Field. We believe really strongly that solutions to many of our problems are found in creation. An example of that would be fire fuel logs made of annually renewable crop material as opposed to a tree that grows for 60 years. Fiber flame fire fuel logs, pit kits, tree seed pens, skeeter logs, skeeter log chiminea, ready flame logs, fire starter sticks. Those are some of our products, there are others. Genuinely green fire burning with no chemicals that meet real human needs. Our flagship product, the Skeeter Lock, has been on the market more than seven years. The end user uses it for a campfire or a grilling experience or a backyard fire pit, and they put the little pieces of Skeeter Logs around their fire. It releases the 80 essential oil formula, and mosquitoes don't eat them up while they're enjoying their outside environment. It will smolder for six hours and is as effective as a half a gallon of insecticide repellent but you can burn the skeeter log very slowly. It'll smolder for six hours. The chiminea is for sitting on your front porch or your deck and not being eaten by mosquitoes. The skeeter log, for example, is made of leftover wood fiber from the lumber industry, from wood product industries. The mighty skeeter log takes about a pound of sawdust, which could turn into an environmental toxin. We own skeeter log in Eastern Kentucky, and I mean that we, with a capital W, for our young people and for our job creation, makes us doubly proud to place this squarely in the mountains. People who are very pleased with every job that's created are building the skeeter log to share with the whole world. But it's terrifying, which means it's equally terrifying and exciting at the same time. That's what Tree of the Field is every day. It's some of the most helpful people along our journey, and that would include the Kentucky Small Business Development Center. I'd like for the Skeeter Log to be available to everybody who wants to buy one everywhere who has a problem with mosquitoes and doesn't want to use artificial insecticides. So sometimes easy things are fighting chemicals. The harder things is to look for the natural, real solutions to our needs.